from being India's richest state, contributing over 12% to the GDP, to having a population that is big enough to rival the top nations in the world. Maharashtra is great in every sense of the word and is a leader in something else too. A trait of inventiveness that runs deep in its people. But poverty can cage even the most enterprising of spirits. Ganpat Rao Watikar, a farmer from Bhagapur village in Yavatmal district, had fallen on bad times. A lack of rains had laid his tact of land barren. I used to buy alcohol with the little earnings I had from selling wheat. There was a lot of tension in the house because we had no money. I was a wastrel, whiling my time away, and even my family were getting sick of me. Dilasa, a Hindi word that means to comfort. It was with this aim that the Dilasa organization was formed in 1994 to improve the lives and livelihoods of farmers. Since the last 10 years, this area has witnessed many farmer suicides. We studied this issue and the reasons became obvious to us. Irrigation was the single most important issue as irrigation increases yields and reduces risk. It was a stroke of pure inspiration that led Dilasa onto its path of innovation. While studying a wandering tribe called Bhangar, they came across a farmer practicing an ancient method of irrigation called FUD, which is essentially a diversion-based irrigation technique. It did not take them long to realize the massive scope FUD had for rain-distressed areas such as theirs. FUD is a Marathi word for a technique of diversion-based irrigation that started off in Nasik during colonial times, where 100-acre compartments were made near the Panjra River. Dilasa has tweaked and added to this technique to make it near perfect for the common farmer. This technique requires no electricity and hence can be replicated in all kinds of areas, even the remote ones. Its cost is extremely low, 10 to 15,000 rupees as compared to 3 to 4 lakh rupees that is the norm in conventional methods. Add to that the low maintenance cost and FUD irrigation becomes a unique method of watershed development that can be replicated across India. With this minimal investment, Yavatmal farmers are now reaping the benefits of increased water flow. Ganpatra Watikar today earns close to 50,000 rupees a month from his fields alone. Not only that, he has now diversified into dairy products after buying cows and buffaloes with his increased earnings. It's not just the farmers who are smiling. Dilasa's flood irrigation project has indirect beneficiaries in the local population as well benefiting as they are from an initiative which requires crane manpower to keep the noble work ongoing. Today with around 900 farmers profiting to the tune of an estimated 14 crore rupees per annum through its FUD irrigation innovation, Dilasa is indeed living up to its name and it intends to keep increasing the smiles as it aims for 400 FUDs in the next three years.